Hi Aries, I hope you're really well. I am Husky Light, welcome to your weekly reading. We are going from today, Monday the 23rd of November through to Sunday the 29th of November and we are starting off with the King of Wands and this is in your health position for this week. Um, King of Wands is rich, vitality, um, he's he's brilliant, he's, he's strong, he's wonderful. He also carries a warning with you with it though in the health position not to overdo things, not to push your body too far, not to push it further than it's able to go. You need rest and you need recuperation. For some of you, it's a critical part of looking after yourself this week. Um, try and determine how you're feeling really deep down this week. If you've got any anger or negative emotions, they can take a toll on your body. They can make you feel unhealthy. They can make you feel under the weather. So be careful. Just don't push yourself to this too much this week. Allow yourself to feel what you feel. Um, but let those feelings out in a positive way and that's going to give you that richness and that vitality um, that you want and what that you're looking for this week. Our next card is in your career and your finance for this week and that's the Queen of Pentacles. Um, could be somebody who is um, around you this week in a work situation. It could be that they're playing some sort of significant role in your work situation. She, she or he, they might have dark hair or they might have dark eyes. They're a friend. They're really on your team this week. They're really supporting you. They're really helping you. Um, and they're, they're really good for you this week. It's like they're coming in just when you need them this week. It could be that you're doing that for somebody else, but I actually feel like it's more for you. Someone's coming in to help you this week and they're really going to be supporting you which is really good. Within finances this week, it's, it's such a good card for finance. Um, your prosperity, your money this week is likely to be on the increase. It's likely to be getting really good for you. Um, go out, do a little bit of a splurge. If that money's coming in for you, go and treat yourself, do something really good for yourself. Saving is really important. Holding back on things is really important. But you know what? If this comes up in your money position for the week um just as long as everything's balanced go and treat yourself go and get that christmas shopping done this week that should be really good for you in your next position we've got the world card and this is in your friends and your family for this week so this can signify that you're pretty much feeling the weight of the world on your shoulders this week um uh, maybe everyone's putting on you, everyone, your friends, your family, um, everyone wants a bit of your time and you just haven't got, you can't split yourself into so many different pieces. Everyone just wants a bit of you this week. It's not an easy place to be or won't be for some of you this week. Um, tell them, tell them you just can't do it this week. You don't have to do everything on your own. Um, it's like you're really, really working hard. You might start to feel it a little bit this week. It's like, can you do this for me? Can you do that for me? Oh, let's go there tonight. Let's go here another night. Um, you need some rest and relaxation this week. If you need to step away from them this week and just say, hey, come on, just give me a break. I've had enough for this week. I just need to sit down for five minutes. Don't feel guilty about it. Don't feel bad about it. Do it because I think you're going to get called upon quite a lot this week and you might not be able to cope with it. And that's all right. That's fine if you can't cope with it. If they are putting all this, I wouldn't be able to cope with it either if I was that busy. They're going to be really putting on you. So just say, look, do you know what? I'm having, I'm happy. You can all stay happy. I'm just having a little bit of a rest this week. You're not going to ask me for so much and I'm not going to do so much for everybody else this week. With regards to your spiritual side, we've got um, the Six of Wands. So it's it's you getting in touch with yourself this week, which is really good. It's you getting in touch with that, that inner child, that deep love of yourself, that love of living. If you need a rest this week because everyone's putting on you, take that rest, nurture yourself and love yourself this week. That's the thing to do. Get in joy 
get in get in touch with the joy that's inside you remember once you've got joy and peace and calm within you it starts to show up on the outside it starts to come up in your reality do that and then everything will be good for you just step back from everybody who needs to be stepped back from this week and take some time for yourself within your spiritual so get a little bit more time go and meditate go and have a walk go and do something wonderful for yourself this week and your last card is the faith card which is the hierophant in other packs and this is in your love position for this week your romance is going really well um, if you're in a long-term relationship that should all be going really well for you but it's going to be going along in a sort of traditional everyday way <laughs> There's going to be nothing out of, the, I don't think there's anything coming out the blue this week for you. I don't think anything's going to, fantastic's going to happen within uh, long-term relationships. It's just going to be bobbing along um, quite happily the way that it usually does. That's good. Um, do things in that way. Don't try and change things. Don't try and do something completely different this, this week because it might just backfire. Um, the best is just to go with the flow this week have faith that everything is okay um, especially if you're in a committed relationship um, there's not a lot of changes going on there it's about actually not making any particular changes this week even if things are not going particularly well for you just try and hold steady till next week <coughs> if you can do not suddenly decide you're going to leave a relationship or you're suddenly going to get into a new one just hang fire until next week right that's your reading for this week i hope you enjoyed it take care namaste love you loads